Georgina Rodriguez and Cristiano Ronaldo's children showed all their talent to become artists. Dear friends, welcome to my channel, I am Maya, hope your day is so well, if you like the video, don't forget to subscribe the channel. The influencer and model shared a moment of creativity and unity between siblings. Georgina Rodriguez and Cristiano Ronaldo's children showed off their artistic inclinations in a recent video that captured the hearts of their followers. Little Bella Esmeralda, just two years old, led her siblings Chris Jr., Alana, Matteo, and Eva in a charming musical performance that was shared by Georgina through her Instagram stories. What was the video shared by Georgina Rodriguez like? In the video, Bella Esmeralda is seen in the role of director of an improvised family choir. With impressive confidence for her young age, she dictated the movements and rhythm of the song to her siblings, who followed her enthusiastically. Georgina, proud of her children, titled the moment My Favorite Conductor, with My Favorite Orchestra at the end of the song. The applause was immediate and little Eva asked for applause for her sister, which ended with a tender group hug. What is the family life of Cristiano Ronaldo and Georgina Rodriguez? Like, this sweet event is just one example of how Georgina and Cristiano foster a loving and creative environment for their children. On her Netflix reality show, Soy Georgina, the model has repeatedly expressed her love and dedication to motherhood. As a child, I dreamed of having a wonderful family, and today I have one, Georgina said in one of the episodes. She describes her children as her greatest blessing and feels fully fulfilled in her role as a mother. What are Cristiano Ronaldo and Georgina Rodriguez's children like? Each of the couple's children has a distinct personality that enriches the family dynamic. According to Georgina, Elena is the most extroverted and was the first to speak, while Eva is more reserved and sensitive, with a strong bond with her mother. Chris Jr. is seen as the ideal eldest son and Georgina's constant companion, and Matteo stands out for his sensitivity and sporting abilities, inherited from his father's talent. For Georgina, there is nothing more important than the time she spends with her family. Despite her busy schedule and high-profile events, the happiest moments for her are those shared with her children and Cristiano. These moments are frequently shared on social media, giving followers a glimpse into the daily life of one of the most famous families in the world of sport and fashion. This recent video, which showcases the artistic potential of the children, reflects the strong family bond that unites them showing us how talent and creativity are values celebrated and fostered in the Rodriguez-Ronaldo home. Ronaldo scores last-minute penalty to secure Al Nasser win against Al Shabab. Al Nasser's victory came in the final minutes as Cristiano Ronaldo's penalty decided the match against Al Shabab. Cristiano Ronaldo scored a dramatic late winner from the penalty spot as Al Nasser defeated Al Shabab 2 to 1 in a thrilling Saudi Pro League encounter. The match saw high tension in the final minutes, with Al Shabab missing their own penalty after Ronaldo's decisive goal. Al Nasser took the lead in the 69th minute when Americ Laporte, the former Manchester City defender, found the back of the net. However, an own goal by Ali Al Hassan in the 90th minute allowed Al Shabab to equalize. Just moments later, Ronaldo stepped up and restored Al Nasser's lead from the penalty spot. The drama didn't end there, as Al Nasser's Mohamed Simakan was sent off for a foul on Nader Al Sharari. Al Shabab had a chance to level again, but Abdur Razak Hamid Allah's penalty was off target. Al Nasser now sit in second place in the league, four points behind leaders Al Hilal. Ronaldo has been in fine form, scoring six goals in seven league matches so far this season. Cristiano Ronaldo's surprising move for Francis Ngannou at PFL leaves fans in a frenzy. At the time when Francis Ngannou and Cristiano Ronaldo first crossed paths, the general consensus was that the two would not meet again, 
it seems like the two superstar athletes have developed a much more cordial relationship with each other, as Kerr 7 dropped by the former UFC champion's locker room before his fight against Renan Pereira in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. As expected, it left many fans in awe. Despite his successful demolition of Renan Ferreira, a whole lot of emotions took over the Cameroonian French star. He dedicated this win to his late son Kobe while breaking down into tears. Cristiano Ronaldo, on the other hand, went through a similar experience when saw his newborn baby tragically pass away in 2022. CR7 who competes in Saudi Arabia decided to drop by Francis Ngannou's locker room, where he had his son, Cristiano Jar, with him as well. The father and son duo were greeted with smiles, hugs, and handshakes by Francis Ngannou and his team. His coaches Eric Nixick, Dewey Cooper, and others were all acknowledged by the Portuguese goal-scoring machine and his son. Before Cristiano Ronaldo decided to have a sit with the Predator, an epic night capped with an epic meetup it was surely one of Francis Ngannou's biggest MMA outings as he registered a statement when fans were understandably moved by Cristiano Ronaldo's gesture towards the new PFL heavyweight Superfights champion. Let's see what they had to say about the heartwarming moment between the Al Nasser captain and the Predator. Francis Ngannou and Cristiano Ronaldo meet up and fans love it. There's no question how big of a star Cristiano Ronaldo is but Francis Ngannou is not far behind. His UFC success and impressive boxing showcases have made Francis Ngannou a well-known superstar athlete who's got a considerable amount of worldwide following. Having developed a close friendship with Ronaldo, some fans told Ngannou, imagine having Ronaldo as your friend, wow, and legend what a respect between these two validating his status as a bona fide star of the fight game. The fans even praised Cristiano Ronaldo, who not only had his son beside him to greet Francis Ngannou, but also gave him much-needed encouragement for his fight. Given how much the former UF champion has been through in the past few months, one fan stated Ronaldo a good man. He knows he needed that moral boost, then some fans chimed in and fired some shots at UF CEO Dana White claiming that he may not like to witness these scenes at the PFL Dana White, had doubts about Francis Ngannou's relevance outside of the UFC. But as we all know, leaving the UFC turned out to be the best decision for Francis Ngannou. His stardom reached another level when he started doing the things he wanted, boxing while also doing MMA, that earned him a lot of fans, including celebrities. As Cristiano Ronaldo proved that fact, one fan stated Dana White crying in the corner of Octagon, taking a dig at White.